Housing activists were back in the fight today, calling on the governor to step in and help those who are struggling to pay their rent and now face eviction. News 12 reporter Katie Lusso has more from downtown Brooklyn. The eviction moratorium may have expired over the weekend, but today the fight continues here outside housing court in downtown Brooklyn. The Brooklyn eviction defense set up shop outside the courthouse. They passed along information about the rights you have as a tenant in New York City. Members of the Crown Heights Tenant Union also stood outside the courthouse and say they won't give up on this fight. They want winter evictions and evictions without cause abolished and the eviction moratorium extended today. They need to extend the universal eviction moratorium through June 30th of 2022 so we can figure out a solution to this crisis. Throwing people into the streets is not a solution to the crisis. It's only a recipe for more crisis. But the Rent Stabilization Association says it's well, time for the eviction to moratorium to be over. Uh, but at the end of the day, building owners have never wanted tenants out of their homes. This is about getting rent money that's been due to them because building owners weren't provided any operating expense relief at any point throughout the pandemic. They had to pay their property taxes, their mortgages, their water and sewer bills, their heating expenses, and there were protections in place to allow tenants to not have to pay the rent if they weren't able to. And he says more should be done by the state to help tenants who cannot afford rent pay their bills. In downtown Brooklyn, I'm Katie Lasso, News 12.